continuation of our video series on how to set a neck, uh, we're going to talk a little bit about how to align your neck and your bridge and some things that you might need. We like to use a long um, straight edge, your actual bridge you'll be using, and a pick guard. Uh, a loaded pick guard is actually better since you'll know for sure that everything's fitting inside the cavity holes. It's a common misconception in putting together guitars that they sort of go together like Legos. Uh, even though everything that we have here is standard spec, it doesn't mean they're necessarily going to drop right in perfectly like a Lego set. So the first thing we like to do once you have your neck at least loosely fitted into the pocket is with this straight edge, very carefully not to damage the finish, is run it along the edge of the neck and check your alignment with your bridge holes. And as you can see, this is, it's good. So now we can test the pick guard. Fit it up against the neck. Check the bridge. And everything looks pretty good. Uh, sometimes you might even want to sand inside the neck pocket of the pick guard or in the bridge opening of the pick guard if maybe things are a little bit too close. Um, but this all just falls under that umbrella, like I said before, that doesn't mean everything's necessarily just going to drop right into place. You may have to work a little bit on it to make everything fit. So now that everything's on here, I'll double check it with the straight edge, check that the bridge and the neck are aligned, everything looks good. So now I'll just bolt the neck on and we're good to go.